We are going to count to one, two, three. I'm launching this project for God and my country. Presidential pledges do not come instantly because presidents make a lot of pledges and they all rotate around the economy. He, because the president himself does not give out money, he gets it from the economy. So, the econo the, the the budget, the budget probably of the the coming financial should include this pledge, because it has been offsetting pledges one by one, one by one. It is not easy. This country has little money, so when it comes to clearing off pledges, it takes time. I'm going to come in because the president the president already has a pledge for the nurses. Is going to put two billion into their circle to enhance their circle. Then, uh, the government will also want to lobby from the minister of Emioga, the uh, Honorable Haruna Kasolo, so that the nurses and midwives, so maybe all health workers, can access this enterprise as well and get money from Emioga fund. It can also enhance their income. Uh, this is a revolving fund which was initiated under the nurses union you know, under their circle to ensure that at least we enhance their incomes, household incomes. This is meant to ensure that one, to improve on the efficiency of uh, transport, because the, the nurses have been suffering with transport. So the Musayu can drop the nurse, then the, the boy can ride and give the nurse, on average at least 10,000, which can be 300 extra income. Then we're also encouraging them to have enterprise at home, such that if you are rearing uh, hens, they are laying eggs, you take your eggs to the market. If you're in horticulture, you can take your product to the market. Yeah, in the bee farming, you can take your product to the market. So the motorcycle can be a mode of transport that can increase on efficiency and transportation of your product to the market. So we encourage them to ensure that at least one, they raise 10 or 1 million, 50,000 shillings, then they can get this motorcycle. With that partner, Simba Automotive, we shall ensure that at least we recover money slowly and ensure that people have their motorcycles, such that at least one will have a side income rather than relying on salary only. The criteria is basically simple. Within the union, they have a circle. So the forms are there. They will go and fill the forms. Then after filling, they pay the money. Then the, the motorcycle is handed to them. Within their locations, because Simba has a lot of branches all over the country. Other unions have also started, and we encourage them to follow suit, such that within their circle, they can now borrow these motorcycles. We are, we are looking at gross, such that tomorrow we can even look at maybe people who want uh, other things like uh, vehicles, People would want other things like mechanizing agriculture, water pumps. We look at this so that at least, we, you know, this, uh, the workers are the vanguard of development. So we are looking at uh, diversifying and expanding. So that at least we can look at a range of. The of Uganda uh, are facing a lot, uh, enormous challenges, especially when it comes to uh, maintaining themselves or what I can call welfare. There is a very big challenge. When you visit a nurse who does not have accommodation, and in some health centers actually they sleep like four, three in one room, and others walk long distances. Uh, so there is a lot that we face while delivering service of health, and it, Uganda Nurses and Midwives Union has thought much about what they can do for these nurses in order to help them generate side income. Uh, we have launched Boda Boda uh, motorcycle project. We want to first of all give all the coordinators to see that the coordinators of the nurses who are also nurses but they are leaders in the regions. We have given them motorcycles and the, the, we are encouraging nurses also who are me meeting challenges in me, reaching work to pay slowly these motorcycles so that they can help them, one, to reach on duty early. Two, while the nurse is on duty, the border border can also uh, be hired to generate income. 
And we are still thinking about more other income generating activities. We have also circles, and these circles, some nurses are also going to, to borrow money to see that they can start other small, small income because the, the, the salaries are very small.